Do you think you're different from a celebrity? Let me stop you there. You're not. Okay? You're not. You're no different from a celebrity. Do you know what, mate? I think you are a f***ing twat. Put it this way. You, you're the producer. You're making this video, okay? That's what you're good at. Now, Nat Natalie Cassidy can't do this. You're better than her at that. She's just better than you at life. If I were to sum up the heat geek in four words, I'd say head like a okay. f***ing donkey. Okay, uh, do you want me to use that, mate? Because um, I, will, I will use it. Would you have <laughs> your penises removed if it saved a million people's lives? What a horrible question. No, bad. I'm not going to lie. You know, I probably you know, wouldn't. You know what? I'd, I'd rather be hated. You won't use it. I will use it. No, you won't. Okay. You're right. a twat. Okay. That's it. I'm going to use it. Okay. Go ahead. We'll Go see, ahead. What, see what happens. Yeah, we'll really. deal with the backlash. So that's Dan. There you go. You see him in his in his in his full glory there. Basically, once had his job in the palm of my hand, and I could have crushed him, and I didn't. And I think I think he knows that. Thank and you. I want to say that whenever I do listen to music, it does actually bring a tear to my eye. Oh, really? Well, how's yeah. that? It's fucking awful. It was about six months ago, and I had the opportunity to feature in the magazine. Um, which you know the opportunity would arise um, every now and again, and I'd, I'd jump at the chance. I'd even um, ask Lucy, the editor, every now and again. I'd send her the odd email saying, you know, do you, any any room in the magazine for me, type thing. And uh, the art team got wind of of my, uh, I wouldn't say obsession, but how much I loved being in the magazine and how much it meant to me to be in the magazine and be part of the magazine. So they thought what we would do is we'll go on a campaign and we'll start mutilating him. The first thing they start to do was wither my arms. It was, um, I called it Withergate. Because I, I work out quite a lot, I try to keep in shape. They negate that with, with a withering process and they basically use Photoshop to make my arms look very skinny. There was one time it landed on my desk, a feature that me and Boyd Hilton, we went off to Ardman Studios to meet up with Davina McCall to go on the million pound drop. Only a kind of a promo thing, we didn't get to keep the money. It was a double page feature, I mean, I mean that's on the money, that is real, you know, panache to get a double page feature in a magazine, you know, that's massive for my profile. I opened the feature, and there it was, a picture of me and Boyd Hilton Davina, arm in arm. Only, they had mutilated me so much that I was vaguely recognisable, you wouldn't even know it was me anymore. They'd basically given me a wee stain, they, they, they'd uh, skinnied my arms, they gave me a tattoo. When, when I first opened it up and I saw it, I just split my sides. I was erupting with laughter. You know, I was just cackling so loud. I don't think I've ever laughed so much. It was just a, a huge sort of like belly laugh uh, filled the whole of the office and everyone sort of stopped what they were doing and looked around at me. I picked up the magazine and Lucy Kay, the editor, she was in the room at, with, in, in, in the conference meeting kicked open the door and I walked straight up to her and I slammed the magazine down and I said, have you seen that? And I put my finger on the picture of me and then I moved it slightly off so she could see what they'd done. And she said, no. And I said, look what they've done to me. And she sort of looked a bit confused. And I said, listen, I'm only going to say this and I'm going to walk out. And I said, I do not want anyone, and I looked straight in her eyes, anyone fired over this. I took my finger off, closed the magazine, I picked it up, tucked it under my arm, turned around and walked out. He's the art director. He was responsible for that feature and I chose not to have him fired over it. I was using the Marvin brand of condoms the other month and it split resulting in my bird getting preggers. Will Marvin agree to pay a small monthly sum to help with the child okay, costs? First of all, that condom definitely did not split because it's an extra safe condom. Fame is a fickle food served on an ever-shifting plate. And now, you know, what, what that means is that you can easily be taken out of context and one minute you're famous and the next minute you're not. 